back to my channel it's your girl tiffany if this is your first time clicking on my video and seeing my face welcome if it's not welcome back babe <laughs> your girl's back okay so as you guys can tell if this is your first time here sis redid a little you know redid the recording room redid the space i've been in a funk i'll probably do a separate video about like what's actually been going on in my life life update um i've been in a funk it's been a lot going on with me with my family mentally and creatively i have not been in a good space i have been very much giving darkness is life very much giving like if you've been around me like if you know me know me you can tell some days my energy has been off and i don't like to come on here when my energy is off and push anything onto you guys because i tend to my energy carries and i don't like to do the most on here with you guys i don't want to come on here and bring you guys down because i know i have i haven't been feeling the greatest like every day so whatever the case may be i just want to tell you guys i missed you whatever this is my first time filming in my recording since i moved it around i'll insert some before and after pictures right here so you guys can see what the tea really is if you're interested who cares but follow me on tiktok follow me on instagram follow me on snapchat all of that all of that subscribe to my channel um today's video is going to be by the title i'm sure it's probably gonna say something like testing out new to me products at the drugstore or testing out drugstore makeup am i late or you know what but whatever the case may be that's what i'm doing um i do have a new eyebrow pencil i didn't do my eyebrows on camera i'll take a second i did show in depth you know the pen i mean the pencil it's on beauty by sharon c um two-in-one brow duo or whatever um I did show this when so when, once we get into the video you guys will see that I have the next can't stop won't stop setting powder look at my face baby I didn't use no translucent powder on my face today I only used this powder she did she need to do I got it from like under eye set in every all my highlighted area setting I didn't get it till I set my whole face and then I also got this um elf bite size palette this is the hot tamale hot jalapeno one of those hot it's one of those um but yeah if you guys are interested in seeing how i got this look because i did go in depth for the new things that i did use if you guys are interested give it a watch okay so i'm super excited about the video which i'm probably sure i'm pretty sure i'll say in the intro i have yet to film my intro because i was gonna wait until i came here on makeup done you know to entice y'all to watch the rest of the video so i didn't do my intro yet but anyway today video you know by the title you know by whatever i say in the intro i'm testing out some drugstore products so my brows are already done which i haven't done in a long time came with well i haven't really recorded in a long time if i'm being honest definitely not reviewing anything but my brows are already done and i used um a new brow pencil from the drugstore super excited about it because i've been dying to try Oma Beauty in general and they have like a sister brand baby brand like up under the blankets of Oma Beauty as a whole collective and they have it at Walmart because I'm pretty sure Oma Beauty itself is at Ulta but I got this from Walmart so um it's the Oma Beauty by Sharon C one and done two and one brow styler Okay, look at my camera trying to work for me today. So on one end you have a pencil. I got the shade 4. And then on the other end you have a brow gel. A little brow styler. So this is what I have on my brows today. And the only thing I didn't use... I mean, the only thing that I added to my brows was obviously concealer because I know I clean my brows with concealer. And I added a little bit of powder on top just because, I don't know, I've been liking how powder brows look. Ever since I started doing like color brows and I used like eyeshadow and stuff for that, I've been really feeling the powder brow look. So that's already done. But I'm gonna be using this e.l.f. bite size eyeshadow palette, Hot Jalapeno. Let me take this sticker off if I can. Okay, this is what the palette is giving. Like I said, it's called the Hot Jalapeno palette. It was three bucks. I can't get it open. It was three dollars. I didn't really need to open it because the top was plastic, but it's three dollars and it's giving it's giving it's giving something. 
I'm not sure, but it's giving something. I'm going to add a little bit more concealer on my lids because I did my um, eyes, my eyebrows like three hours ago, three and a half hours ago. So retention, hello. But I'm going to go ahead and add some primer to my lids and then we'll get started on the eyes. Okay, so I zoomed you guys in and I'm going to be taking the deepest shade first. I don't know if I'm going to be adding any, um, if I'm doing like cut crease action or what I'm doing, but I'm, we're going to figure it out. It's a little bit of kickback in the pan, but like it's giving pigment though. Like it's giving, it's got a little kickback. It got a little, it's, it's biting a little bit. It's like, wait a minute. Elf. I don't think I've ever used the Elf eyeshadow palette, but baby, they said this bite size is going to do what it do. Mm. That is a baby. That looks good. Oh, oh that looks good. Okay, so. I'm gonna take this Wet n Wild brush. I've had this brush for years, and I'm gonna take the lighter shade of green. It's not as light as I would like it, but I'm not trying to dip into any other colors. So I'm just gonna take this and go around the edges, just so it's blended and not harsh, even though this is still a pretty deep color, honestly. But I'm, if y'all can't tell, I'm very shocked. I'm shocked by the pigment that Miss Elf is giving. I am shocked. I'm in awe. This is crazy. Okay, so I'm going to cut my crease. Wow. Oh, she, she hasn't cut her crease in a long time. Does she even still know how? And I'm going to use the LA Girl Pro Concealer to do that. We're gonna see, we're gonna make it do what it do. Oh, I got it. baby we're getting a halo eye okay i am going to i got it i got it i got it put that dark shade oh you ate these shadows up baby you ate it up. Okay, let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see something. Okay. Should I use a mat? Let me see what the mat is given in the middle. It's not giving much. So I'm going to use this light green. I mean, this green shimmer. <gasps> Bitch. This is without a primer. I mean, not without a primer, without what in my brush. Elf ate this up. 
e.l.f. ate this up. Okay, I'm going to go off camera and do my other eye and my foundation so we can speed this along. Okay, so my face, my eyes are done. Well, except for like my under eye, but my eyes are done. Now I'm going to use this powder. I'm so excited. I've heard such good things about this powder. And the Can't Stop Won't Stop Foundation is pretty good. I haven't used it in a while, so I don't know actually how it is now. But before, when it first came out, it was pretty good. So I have... I can't open it! Yeah, let's get our shit together. Okay. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay. So I'm going to... Where's my brush? Wait a minute. Okay. I'm going to take my brush. Let me see. This Morphe brush from the Jaclyn Hill collection. JH07. So it's pretty old, but it's pretty legit. This is the Lunar Beauty um, sponge. I dip it in. Okay, got a little bit of like cake. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Give me one second. I'm back. So I am gonna go ahead and um, bronze on here with you guys. How about my bathroom ceiling is leaking and my hallway ceiling is given that it's about to start leaking too and I'm trying to figure out what is given because truly it ain't given what it's supposed to give okay so I'm gonna be using the Juvia's Place the Warrior 2 by Juvia's Place palette y'all see me use this palette several times I don't know if y'all ever seen me use it to bronze but I have been doing that I'm gonna use this shade and these two shades for blush so but yeah I like hear something and I kind of thought it was my children at first but then in my head, I'm like, that doesn't make any sense. Even though they were out there doing stuff, they didn't have no business. That's that's a fact. But I'm like, no, it's not them because it's, it sounds like it's coming from the bathroom. And I know they can't get into the bathroom because the, our bathroom is locked. We lock it from the outside so they don't just, you know, go in there all willy-nilly. I go check in the bathroom. Why is it hella water already on the floor, gleading all the way up to um, the door, and it was still leaking? Like, huh? So, needless to say, if they don't get the leaking under control, they better move us to an empty apartment for the night. Because... Or they're best to pay for a damn hotel or something. Because that is crazy. We can't even literally, I couldn't even walk in the bathroom because it was leaking so bad. Like, it's ridiculous. I just don't understand. I don't get it. We know I live for a blush moment. So don't, don't come for me. I'm actually only using this shade in the middle for blush. But this palette is a banger. Truly a banger. Okay, so I'm going to also put some on my nose. I'm just using this lightest shade to get my nose a little before I add any highlight because we're going to add some highlight. But yeah, this been sound like shit didn't paint up there. And I'm like, I get it, bro. You got some shit going on? Because same. Same, okay? It's crazy as hell down here at my apartment. So I ain't even worried about none of that. But it be, they be overdoing it a little bit. It really be given. When Miami said, you don't give a fuck about your friends, it really be given, you don't give a fuck about your neighbors. Like, that's what it be given. Like, it's, I'm laughing, but like, it's not funny. Like, I know my kids be wild, but I like, I try to keep them as subdued as possible. Baby wild out there. I'm using that same can't stop won't stop powder to add a little pop to my nose. Ma'am? Sir? 
My man's a little bit under here. Excuse me? Did y'all just see that? <laughs> but the gag is, look how good my skin looks. And I haven't even said. Y'all know a lot of the times when I put powder on, it be giving powdery. Like, it be very much giving. Mm, mm, mm. Like, it really be giving it. So, I'm going to use this Urban Decay Mainline. It's the blue one I have. It's the only, it's the closest one to green, so. Of that, probably the lighter green. It's not light, but it's not the darkest one. And the... We gotta see that. giving very smoky very unintentionally i really thought it was gonna be like a medium look but it had other plans i'm just gonna add i'm obsessed with this powder now i'm just gonna add this powder on my inner corners that way it lightens it up a little bit Ooh. okay yeah that's deep enough i don't want to add any more eyeshadow because I'm not trying to look crazy. So I got this lip gloss from um, HS Cosmetics. It's a small business. I'll leave the link to her website down below. Um, I actually don't want to use a lipstick too. Do I have a lipstick up here? If I have a lipstick up here, I'll also be using her lipstick. But if not, then I won't. I'm not seeing it. But I'm going to use the gloss. So I'm going to take this lip, NYX lip liner in Espresso. You already know. Do y'all see that? Do y'all see the flawlessness of it all? She did that. So I'm going to take this Desi and Katie Fuego highlighter. Don't even at me. I know it's old, bro. Don't even at me. Because I'm going to use it until my face starts falling off. Spray with this e.l.f. Matte Magic Mist and Set. And I'm gonna pop on my Markel lashes from Beautifully Lace, of course. Link will be in the bio if you like to purchase my lashes. We have two pair, Markel and Deshaun. So check them out or anything on the site. This hair wrap is also from Beautifully Lace. So if you were looking, wondering about that, that's where you can get that. But okay, let me go on camera, pop my lashes on. We will, we will resume. Okay, so this is the finished look. Let me zoom you guys back in a little bit. Can we get into it? Get into it. What does you say? Get into it, yeah. Honey. This powder? Yeah, so when I got off camera, I didn't do any additional powder. I did add some of this powder like on my brow bone because I felt like my eyes was giving way too dark. I needed to like soften it up a little bit. But I didn't put no loose powder on today. None. Not a one. Not to carve my cheeks out or nothing. I use that powder everywhere I highlight it. I use it on my nose. You guys saw on my forehead, on my chin, under my eye, and her knee. Okay, is giving what she needed to give. These lashes, 
I give what they need to gave. Technically, my stuff isn't in the drugstore or my website, but like it's affordable. So if you like these lashes and the serving is giving looks, it's giving a look. Check out my website. It's that in the description box below. But um, that's all I have for this video today. So if you enjoy watching it, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below. If you made it to the end of the video, give me, can y'all leave a green heart down in the comments? If y'all made it to the end of the video, leave a green heart yellow real one it's good for the algorithm leave me a green heart so like i'll tell you guys i'm your tiffany thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video